Hey guys, it's Lisa, and today we're going to do a top rated anthropology haul. And if you're familiar with anthropology, they have good stuff. I was thinking this morning of just what makes anthropology different, and I think it's just very much good quality. I would say decent prices. This is going to be a little bit higher than your Gap, Zara, H&M, but these pieces seem to be more like statement pieces like statement clothing, statement dresses. You can get some basics and I do have a few, but what I love about anthropology is that's the first place I go when I have a special event. But then they're also good about having several styles and brands that they keep year after year and you can get in different prints. So it's just a good place and you guys have always enjoyed anthropology hauls in the past. So we're gonna start off with this fabulous skirt that I'm wearing today. And in the video, I paired it with this bodysuit, which is the ballet bodysuit. And it comes in a pink color and this black. Very sexy, yet a very versatile piece. You could also wear this, you know, under a blazer, etc., etc. It's just a good piece to have. It is double lined up here. It's more of a cottony fabric than the strappy bodysuit from Zara and it's just a little bit different of a look and it does have adjustable straps and it is the Anthropology brand. I have found that I really do like their brands. Like last year for the style conference, I got a pair of jeans. I think they're the Pilcro. I don't think it's exclusive to their website, but it is a very popular brand on Anthropology. And then Anthropology also has their own line of clothing. So anyway, this is the bodysuit. I really liked it. I will have all of the links and the sizes listed below. This is actually a small medium, so that's perfect. That's what I am, is a small medium, and I loved it. Now this skirt, I think, is self-explanatory. I mean, what is not to love about this skirt? It's a beautiful color. I love the ruffles on this, and it is so versatile. Please don't let something like this intimidate you. I say that because it would have me probably five years ago or so. I actually bought a black one for the style conference and I'll put a picture of it up here and I just didn't end up getting to wear it, but I still have it and I love it and I'm looking forward to styling that again. Another thing that got me attracted to the ruffled skirt is I don't know how many of you watch Alyssa Beltempo. She has a ruffled skirt, kind of like this. I think hers is like a taupey gray color and I love seeing all the different ways that she styles it. And she said that she pulls it out a lot for cocktail dinners, you know, more fancy occasions. But honestly, the way I like it is, you know, just how I have it right now with a tank or a bodysuit. And then of course you can put sweaters. You could put like your J. Crew sweater with it, those light cashmere. You could put a cardigan. And of course I'm gonna drag out <laughs> Honestly, the Zara linen blazer that I've been wearing so much lately, that looks phenomenal with it. This little cropped denim jacket with it would look amazing or the white gap jacket. But I feel like I could go on and on, but I want to get to the other pieces. Very, very versatile and this it reminds me of that dress that Carrie wore on the Sex and the City movie in Paris. I don't know, it's extra special. Okay, the next piece is something I was excited to try. My friend Marnie, Miss Gold Girl, always brags about the Somerset dress. So I decided to try one and I tried the Somerset mini dress. I got it in the small and it did fit, but I am going to probably return this and size up to the medium so that it falls a little bit longer. Because of my long torso, sometimes I have to do that. And that's just a good tip all the way around, especially for mature women. I think sizing up or going with the tall version, you know, if you want to cover more of your knees, your legs, think about things like that. Think about the same style, but in a different sizing. So I am going to size up to a medium, but I absolutely loved this dress. It is so fresh, fun. I love that it's just 
this open neckline with like the smocking and it's like the poplin cotton material and all of these things come in several different patterns and colors so what i'm going to try to do is put some different ones up so you can see because that is the beauty of it if you find a dress like this that you like get it in every color. That is going to make getting dressed so easy. That is what I used to do, especially when I had young children and I wanted to look good, but I wanted it to be easy because you know you can't spend a lot of time on yourself during those younger years. And so I would find a dress that I liked and I would buy it in every color. I would find a pair of shoes that were comfortable, but I liked, and I would wear probably the same two or three pair of shoes. So this is a great dress to wear with flip-flops, with wedges. You could put the little gold bow sandals, and it does have a little snap right here so that it doesn't come too far open, but just a beautiful dress. Now, this is something else that I got, this little baseball cap. It is not going to look good on me today because my hair is, I let it naturally dry, but I love a good, baseball cap, especially in the summertime, by the pool, at the beach, or just every day. It's a good, I don't want to worry about my hair, but you still look like a cool girl. And they actually had this with the girl wearing the Somerset mini dress, and I thought it looked so cute. You could also put on your little tennis shoes. I don't even think people wear these anymore, but do you guys remember Keds, just white Keds? how classic they were and we wore them with so many dresses and everything in the summer. Matter of fact, I've already got my next cart going for anthropology and I put in a pair of those Hirachi sandals because I loved those in my teen years and I want to try those again. So they had several good hats and I will say this fits so good. I'm gonna put it on anyway. If you have a big head like me, of course it is adjustable, but I love it and I feel like it is the perfect like cut right here. I just love it. This was probably my biggest surprise of all. This is the Maeve, which is one of their brands, and it is the Cassandra Maxi Dress. It comes in several different prints, and when I first pulled it out of the box, I thought, oh my goodness, why did I order this? Because it is so different than anything else I usually would get or wear. But I love the print. You know I love a flutter sleeve, and I do love that vacation vibe dress. You know what I mean? like sitting out on your front porch, sitting out on my back porch, the kids are riding their bikes, the people are coming in from being on the boat and everything, the ice cream man is riding around. I love that feeling. And when I put this on, at first I thought, wow, it really fit a lot better and a lot more flattering than I thought it would. And I went and showed John, he wasn't crazy about it, but Brooke was helping me take pictures and we both really loved it. And he, I went back in there, I said, I actually really like this dress. I felt really pretty in it. It had such a good fit and a good flow. It's not bulky. He said, yes. Yeah. So he said, I think it's pretty. It just kind of looks like a muumuu. <laughs> but I love it. I love it. And most all of these dresses do have pockets and just the detail. See how it has like the pleating right here. It has a ruffle at the bottom, which I am not typically a fan because I feel like it's, I don't know, a lot of bulk at the bottom, but this was not bulky. And the fact that it is a maxi dress, it was just really good. I can just imagine if any of you like to wear like beads, this with a really cool pair of Birkenstocks, I think would look really good. So I really like it. I'm keeping it. I think it is a really nice dress. Very good quality and a really cool look. Okay, this just has to make you smile. This is another dress by Anthropology, and it is the peregrine dress. And I just love the color combination of this dress. Let's see, it still has the price on it. So it's 160. It's a little bit of a higher price point than Zara or H&M, but it is a nicer weight fabric a lot more detail and I think more of a forever or several season dress. I think that there are just times when you want to shop for, like I say, sometimes a one hit wonder or a one event type thing, but this is going to be just a great piece. Here again, it has the ruffle on the bottom, but it did not bother me. These dresses just have that great fit. It's like they don't overwhelm your frame. They fit well, but yet it's such a pretty sexy vibe, but 
in a conservative type way. Like this is the kind of dress you could wear to a outdoor wedding, a summer wedding, all of the things that come with a wedding or a baby shower. I know it's that time of year. A great dress to take on vacation. And I am the kind of person, I want to feel good all day, all around my home. Every time I look in the mirror, I want to feel good about myself. And so I wear dresses and skirts all the time. So just love this, love the print. I will add some variations and I just can't say enough good about it. It's very, very flattering too with this cut because it's very fitted through here. Okay, last but not least, you guys, if you don't get anything from this video, you need this sweatshirt. It was on the top rated and I see why, and I've already got the gray one in my cart. You know how there are just those sweatshirts that you can hardly wash and dry before you want to wear them again? That's how this is going to be. It comes in several colors. I know one of them is lavender. I'm getting the gray and I did get the small, but it is, let me show you. See how it's got that cut neck right there. It's again, the Pilcro brand, which I love. The perfect little sleeves. Yesterday when I wore it, I just loved it all day. It's not really cropped as far as like this, but it's cropped enough so it was still like breezy. It's a really good sweatshirt for the summer. And I know that doesn't make sense, but if you live in a really hot climate, it does because a lot of times it's freezing everywhere you go and you just need something like this. It's really cool. I love that the waistband is just straight like that. It's just a really, really cool sweatshirt. And I think that all of you would love this. I tried it on with the khakis from my latest Gap haul. If you didn't see it, I'll put it up here because there were some good things in that. And it looked so good. And then later on in the day, I ended up putting this on with my sweatpants from Aviator Nation and loved it. At first I threw on my Crocs, but I ended up putting on my flip-flops and just loved it. So this would just be a good piece for everyone. This also is something that I used to, now I'm loving my silky pajamas, but I used to love to sleep and stuff like this. When I had small kids and we had to get up early, there for a while, Will had to be at school at 7.30 and then Brooke at 8.30. So I would take him, come back, get Brooke, take her. And I liked to almost sleep in things that I was gonna wear the next day to take them to school. This is something good for that too. Okay, I could not resist showing you how good this oversized linen blazer looks with this outfit. And I just have on my Javiana flat form flip flops, but this is what I'll wear today. Now I've had some feedback that a lot of you don't like the oversized blazers, that's fine. I'm just giving you different ideas. If you like something more fitted, then I would just choose more of your fitted blazer. Another thing that I tried on this morning that looked really good with this skirt was just a vest, a button up kind of like suit vest in cream and I have a black one, that would look good too. So don't feel like when I show you something, that's your only option. We all like different things. I mean, you can be best friends and think you love all the same stuff and you're gonna have different opinions. So that is the beauty of it. That's why we do these videos, to give good ideas. I want to show you how things fit on a mature woman because a lot of times when we look at these websites, they're shown on very thin young girls, which they're beautiful. And I don't deny that nine times out of 10, you know, the clothing is gonna look good on these young girls. It's nice to see what it looks like sometimes on a mature woman. So this is actually, I hope you can hear me, what I will be wearing today. I just love it. And I just can't say enough good about this skirt. I guess you can tell how much I love it. And I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here for my accessories. I have on my little beaded bracelet from Dean Davidson, my Jenny Bird cuff. I felt like a watch didn't really fit with this whole vibe I was doing today. My nails are the China Glaze, Rose Among Thorns. Of course, some good old hoops for this whole look. And today I use a lot of the makeup, if not all, <laughs> from one of my videos, how to get like that summer glow with your eye makeup, your skin, your body makeup, everything, or body lotion, everything. So I will put it in here somewhere. So make sure you watch that video and I will see you guys the next time. Bye-bye.